Cindy Otter here with my Artsy Endeavors. How are we doing today? I'm doing pretty good. I've received another entry. This one is from Erin, which I'm not going to let her um, address show. But this one is from Erin. Erin actually put out a note about um, she had some jelly prints that um, she wanted to get rid of. So I said, sure, I'll take a few to put into my journal. And I told her, I said, while you're at it, throw in a name and we can use it as a um, entry. So um, her entry for my contest name for my journal is my giant collaborative junk journal. I like that. Okay, let's check out these jelly prints. Oh my god, oh, I love that one. Isn't that cool? Look at all the colors, that is gorgeous. Really, really, really love this. Very cool. Oh, so pretty! Look at these. You know, it is so cool seeing other people's jelly prints. This one's cool too. You know what? These are done. Ooh. These are done on a cardstock. So these actually could be used as covers, as journal covers. I love that. And it's funny because that's just a wipe off of some stencils. And I love that. That's gorgeous. Look at the colors. That, wouldn't that make a really cool journal cover? Look at that. So neat. Don't mind my hands. I'm cold. Um, I've got my pellet stove on and running, but it's not warmed up enough in here for me yet. Look at this. So beautiful. It's funny. It feels like there should be a lot of texture there, but there's actually not. You feel a little bit of texture, but isn't that gorgeous? Erin, these are beautiful. i got to check on the back because you never know what you put on the back. So pretty love the metallic paint you know that's not something I use enough of and that's something I need to use more of is the metallic paints look at this so pretty these would make wonderful flowers um, they would make they'd be great for any type of punch outs or die cuts absolutely fantastic And again, we've got the metallic paints. And like I said, I don't use them enough. I need to use them more. This is beautiful. Oh, love these. Look at that. These are absolutely gorgeous, Erin. Thank you. So look at this one. Again, it's a heavy card stock, so that could be a journal cover. How f look at the glitter. You see it? How fantastic is that? I love these. These will definitely be put to good use. Um, I don't know as all of them will make it into my mega journal because some of these I may just have to do journal covers on. They're just too pretty not to. Look at that. Wouldn't that be great? So Erin, thank you so much for your um, for sending these to me. I really, really appreciate it and I love this. So beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay. Um, I will definitely put your name in the running for the names, the contest name. And so far, these are what I have. Um, I have From Around the World and Me, Miss Stupendous, Wow, Meg, and Fat Bottom Girl. And I also have my giant collaborative junk journal. Okay, um, I will be right back. All right, sorry about that. Phew, I'm out of breath. Um, my doorbell rang, and <laughs> it doesn't ring that often. Normally, you know, whoever we know is coming or whatever, they just come on in. But I thought I heard a sound. I'm like, what is that sound? It was my doorbell ringing. So I just got a couple packages. But All right, so what I was saying is we have from around the world in me, which is just by, from Elizabeth. From Miriam, we have Miss Stupendous. Wow, from Crystal. Meg from Patricia, Fat Bottom Girl from Lottie, and now my giant collaborative junk journal from Erin. Let me just put that on this list. 
Okay, and if you haven't seen this before, here she is. This is the junk journal that we're talking about. She's huge. This is her spine. Um, I don't know why it's a she, but it's a she. <laughs> and these are some strings that belong there. But this is a junk journal that I actually went through and made with a whole bunch of just that, junk. And I was sitting here just putting some odds and ends in, and I thought, you know, I really need a name for this girl. So um, here she is. Uh, the front part of it, I've put a bunch of stuff in, but it's going to take me a lot. And I'm going to say um, quite a while to fill this up, to work in her, and just make her crazy. So if you're interested in putting a name in or um, would like to see something put into this journal, you need to get it to me before the end of the year. Uh, January 1st, I am going to pick the name. I'm not going to do a random selection. I, I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it. I don't know if I'll stick them in a bucket and pick randomly. I'm not sure yet. But um, here she is. You can either send me a postcard or an ATC or a little package of goodies, whatever you'd like. If you just want to send me a letter with a name suggestion, that'd be fantastic. Um, but if you want to see something put into this journal, like I said, everything that I receive for this is going to go in this journal. It's all going in here. So... Um, with the exception, I'm sorry, Aaron, of a couple of those jelly prints, I probably will use those for uh, journal covers. So anyways, I hope you guys um, check this out and send me a name and let's see what we can come up with for 2017, okay? As always, be kind, have fun, that's what life's all about. Happy creating and we'll talk to you soon. Bye!